Hello, welcome to the video. Like, subscribe, comment, and let's get into it. So, sorry about the uh, lack of uploads. This is um, FNAF UCM review. Fuck yeah. <laughs> um, uh, so, we'll first look at... This is going to be a much more detailed one. Um, so, we're going to first look at the gameplay. So, the gameplay for FNAF 6 is... Not FNAF UCM. Is incredibly replayable. This is definitely the most replayable FNAF game. That and FNAF 6, because there's quite a lot you can do in the Tycoon. But I would wish there was more. Anyway, this is not FNAF 6, I'm going off track. Um, FNAF UCM has got so much replayability. Um, you can make, like, you could do, like, Melody Mavericks. Um, what? Why does it say Melody Mavericks? Uh, Mediocre mel Melodies, like, you know. Um, Pizzeria. Or you could do, like, Rockstar Animatronic Pizzeria. Or something cool like that, you know? Um, and there's so much replayability. I think the replayability is good. It is a little bit confusing, I'll be honest. Um, it can be quite a task, um, to, you know, get in, um, used to the controls, let's say. Especially if I've been playing on console, but, um, that's not the game's fault. That's just because it's poorly optimised on console. Um, yeah, um, that's one problem with the game. Um, the console, which isn't great, but, you know, I don't blame it. It's pretty hard adapting to console, and it's pretty good for what they did. Um, hmm. And then, for gameplay, I give it a 9 out of 10. Lore. There's going to be three parts. Gameplay, lore, and, well, animatronic design. Lore. It's a very good lore-based game. For what it was, a th you know, thought out to be. You know, everyone was thinking, okay, this is going to be just, you know, a fun, you know, game. It's not going to have any lore relevance. And then you get a fucking cutscene such as, it could be anime fucking, um, Freddy cartoon stuff. That was really cool. Um, there was the weird high school chica thing which was meant to represent William Afton but Toy Chica, Toy, Toy chica is not William Afton um unfortunately <laughs> <laughs> oh god um and yeah for law it's really good it shows what I think should have been the end to William Afton um my personal opinion I don't think Lake Trump should have happened I think the security breach should have just focused on Maybe having, like, a little bit of William Afton, like, still alive. Um, but, like, you know, only enough to, like, maybe, like, um, corrupt Van, Van, Vanessa a little bit. Like, she goes into, like, the old pizzeria or something. As, like, an investigator. And then, like, he corrupts Fanny with, like, the little bit he has. And then that's how it, like, she goes a bit crazy. That could be fun. Instead of, you know, William Afton being in a video game, and then the cat main character being a fucking idiot and not taking off the headset. Here's how to beat FNAF um, VR, by the way. You take off the headset. You get a hammer. You smash the headset into tiny pieces. You dig a hole to hell. You pour the bits down to hell. You send lava down the hell. The hell, oh, the hole. Sorry, you send lava down the hole. You wait until the lava fall, falls out. You dig until you find the remains. And then what you do? Is you get a catapult. You shoot the fucking thing to nothing. You hit it into a fucking wall. And then, and then, and then, what you do? So you get a gun, and you shoot it, and shoot it, until it doesn't exist anymore. ASMR loud. <laughs> no, 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 no. Um, I'm just kidding, but that was a bit joke. Um, yeah, um, law relevance is amazing for this game. For considering what it was, you've got to admit. Scott did a good job with this game. Overall, it's one of the best FNAF games, I'll be honest. It's just so good. Um, yeah. Um, 
And finally, animatronic designs. Uh, I would give Law a 8 out of 10. Animatronic designs. I can't say that any any of them are new. Um, because they're just, in the end, you, but none of them are really new characters. Sure, there's a few new characters, like Shadow, Dee Dee, and Dee Dee. That's it. Um, even though Dee Dee isn't new, I suppose Shadow Dee Dee is probably the only new one. Um, but, obviously, I'm trying to design to can't be perfect because Phantom BB's there. Obviously, that's impossible if Phantom BB's there, but you know, it gives it a good go for what it has, so I can respect that. Um, I give animatronic designs because it has really iconic and really, well, <laughs> let's just say, um, hated designs, it gets a 8 out of 10 again. Because the bad designs, like most of the phantoms, I'll be completely honest, um, bring it down a little bit for me. Um, and now, full gameplay and like everything mixed. Overall, I think <sighs> FNAF UCN is like a would be like a nine point eight out of ten. But because it doesn't work like that, I'm gonna give it a nine and a half. And you, you need to know that it would be 9.9. 9.8, sorry. What, I don't think it would be 9.9. Maybe I should know that. Um, yeah, that's how it would be. So, yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, I'd appreciate a like, comment, subscribe. Um, do whatever the fuck you want. Have a fantastic day. It's been Pastor Perry Chicken. Listen to this fantastic music. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.